favorite of the show. Yes, definitely a favorite. And uh, she's going to be uh, here. You got to watch out there, Harry, because Jess Apple's coming in here. Um, she's coming in hot. See, for news for all your listeners, CBS, the big TV station, uh, the big uh, channel there, they banned <laughs> me gotcha. from having any of their guests on the show. Corny. So. Hello. Hello, Leslie Zen. This is Davey Love from Modern Problems Radio Show. How are you doing this evening? I'm good. How are you? I'm good looking as always. <laughs> <laughs> Let me introduce you to the cast of characters. We got some more this time, some new and improved ones. Okay. All right. We got uh, the producer extraordinaire, Mr. J. Say hello. Hi. How are you doing, Leslie? Hey, J. We have uh, one of your old friends, Jay Spin. Leslie, welcome back. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. And we have sexy Jess Apple. Hi, Leslie. Nice name. Well, I like that. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and we have musical guest uh, Quincy Mumford, who's, g- who's huge right now. So he just played What's in here. What's up? What's up, doll? <laughs> <laughs> so I... Uh, just for the listeners, I, Leslie is a good friend of ours, and she's also uh, one of my favorite guests. And I told her about what happened with uh, CBS TV. They said that they will not allow us to have any guests from any of their shows ever again because I'm not family friendly, and we don't because we interview porn stars. Which Leslie came right to bat for us on that one. Yes, I did. <laughs> it's, it's a damn shame. Thank you for it that. is. You know the funny thing about it? As I was thinking about that. Um, when you mentioned that, look at one of the biggest uh, television series right now, Game of Thrones. Like, if that's not softcore porn, I don't know what is. <laughs> right. Uh, yeah, it's, I agree. It, it's crazy. It's totally crazy. But, yeah, that, that's, that's acceptable. Uh, I don't understand what the difference really is. <laughs> yeah, totally. I, I don't get it either. Um it's a damn shame, you know, but what It's are just we an do? example <laughs> of the man trying to keep us down. Yeah, and I don't care. I'm not going to change because I love I love the ladies and uh, we don't bend. Yeah, we don't. And and you guys Door. are our favorites. And Leslie, <laughs> you're one of my favorites definitely. So No, thank you very much. Have you seen the new scene? Yes, I did. I did my research. Very hot. <laughs> He's been on. talking about it. I need a, I need a doctor. <laughs> you need a doctor? It's yes. so funny because I did that scene, I'm trying to think, because they hold on to scenes for so long. So when they release certain scenes, I'm like, oh, wow, I completely forgot I did that one. <laughs> <laughs> and this one, this one I did um, last fall, like November or December. Wow. And I'd completely forgotten about it. And it was just funny because it was like the first one I actually did in a group of scenes that I was doing. And they've released all the other ones. And this, so I completely forgot about it. But it turned out pretty well, I have to say. <laughs> it, it definitely turned out well for me, I thought. I thought it was great. <laughs> no, for, well, thank you. For all our listeners, Leslie is, is such a highly requested actress that she only does how, how many scenes do you do a year? Like five or six. <laughs> five or wow. six. See, that's that's when you're making the big bucks. Yeah, five absolutely. or six scenes. <laughs> I'm in the wrong business. You are not in the wrong business. <laughs> well, <laughs> <laughs> well you, oh. <laughs> Jay Spin, I, I'll shoot a porn for you. It'll be called Just the Tip, but that'll be all that's in there. Uh-huh. <laughs> that's, that's, that's insane. <laughs> Yes, it is, definitely. So when are we going to get you up here in the area? I know last time that we interviewed, you were in New York and uh, doing stuff. So we, a lot of people have been asking us since we're friends, when is Leslie Zen going to come in studio? And I didn't mean in by come studio. in studio like the way everyone thinks, but you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, know. I think I'm actually uh, going to be up there somewhere in uh, November. Oh, around, very like, nice. The first, first couple weeks of November, I usually try and come right before the Christmas tree lighting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Can I go under that Christmas tree? <laughs> <laughs> what happens under That's the mistletoe? Oh, yeah. Th- what does happen under the mistletoe? Yeah, I love mistletoe. I, it's funny because I'm actually um, I'm like a Scrooge. I haven't done Christmas in probably 15 years. And uh, Thanksgiving and Halloween are my big holidays. But right. uh, I'm going to actually do Christmas this year, like the whole tree and everything. It's going to oh, be kind of nice. crazy. Very nice. 
Now, when you shot your scene uh, that was last fall, that was before. Was that shot in California? That was before the uh, no condom rule, the condom rule in L.A. Correct. Yes, it was. I have not actually been out there yet since they did all of that. Um, it was. I think I shot out there um, November, December. I was out there one week in November and one week in December, and I did a handful, of, like three or four scenes each trip. Um, and yeah, that was before. I didn't even know. Is, has that been a rule? Is that a new rule now? Yeah, it's a, <laughs> I they, don't even know. <laughs> they made a law now that uh, any films uh, you have to uh, wear a condom now in L.A. So that's why I said, like, or in California, that's the law. So I'm thinking they're probably going to start moving the scenes probably to New York. I would say. Yeah, I mean, I really, to be honest, I really, I, I mean, I know the viewers seem to have a problem with it, but to be honest, I it really doesn't bother me one way or the other um right. condoms doesn't is you know it doesn't really make uh, make or break the scene for me it might for the guy <laughs> right um if you if you use the right condoms you really can't tell if you've been there to be honest um so it's not gonna be a big deal to me but i i don't know how the guys feel about it i'm sure they're not too tickle pink about it <laughs> <laughs> probably not but that's why i said i think they'll probably move it you know because I don't think that uh, Brazzers or any of the other ones are going to want to do scenes like that because it's really not. It wouldn't well, they have. They have. It's funny. Maybe that's why I've had a couple people, which I would love, actually. I've had a couple people tell me, because um, I'm scheduled. It's usually the time of year that everybody starts contacting me to shoot. And I've had a handful of people tell me they're going to be in Florida shooting. Oh. So maybe that explains why they're going to be in Florida shooting. Yeah. So, that's you can't do it in LA, so Florida is going to be the next spot. Can you? In, I'm sure. You, can you in Vegas? I guess Vegas is yeah. The other. Vegas is good. I think. I'm sure. Brazzers. Brazzers has a studio in Florida and in Vegas and in LA. Oh, so there you go. Very nice. They would just start shooting all their scenes in Vegas and, and Florida probably. Now you you're not under contract with any company right now. You're just freelance. You I can... never have been actually. Ah. I've been my own manager and I've done everything. I am the most stubborn, hard-headed person you've ever met. So I pity anybody that <laughs> would want to try to manage me. I'm actually hard-headed right now. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh. Um, I uh, I'm I'm a handful, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm sure you're more than a handful. More than two, definitely. 